Welcome to our ripped horizontal template. I'm going to show you a quick demo of what some possibilities are for this template. With this template, it can be very easy to insert your subjects. You're just going to open up your insert subjects here and then have your subjects extracted. I'm going to grab a couple Photoshop documents of my extracted subjects here, drag and drop. They're going to appear in there and you can resize them, move them around and get them to fit however you want to. can incorporate a lot of different players or just a few by making them bigger or smaller. For example, if I had a bunch of volleyball players, I could make them all quite a bit smaller and fit a ton of them in there if I needed to. And if I make them bigger, they can go out over top of the rips. You don't have to photograph them individually. Here's a team I photographed all together. I've extracted them. I'm going to drag and drop them in there and then resize them to fit. just like that. Although when you photograph them individually, you have the option of moving them individually higher or lower to get them to fit exactly within this template. So it's often my preferred way. I uh, can modify any of the colors. There's a full tutorial that'll teach you how to locate all this stuff. We go down to the paper here, double click and adjust this to, for example, blues. And then I'm going to go up to the other paper layer here and I'm going to change this color. I can keep it the same color as the blue if I want to like that, or I could change it and add a little bit of like tint or orange to it to match up to their team that way too. You can completely decide on any of these colors what color it is. You can even shut off the hue saturation and it gives it a cool craft paper look also. There are some optional claw and talon rips. So these are the claw rips here. And these are the talon rips, so if you have like the bears, cougars, lions, tigers, wolverines, anything like that, look awesome with the claws, uh, the talons, eagles, hawks, things like that, ravens, whatever can be there. You can duplicate these, move them around, add more, larger ones. You can put them different spots in there. They look kind of cool just about anywhere. You can change out the logo quickly and easily. Simply shut off the sample logo and have an extracted logo that you can drag and drop into there to get to fit. Of course, you can change any of the text and modify it to your needs. Another feature I built into there is that you can add the subject signatures or little notes to the team that they'd want to incorporate into the poster. You can also widen the rip. And there it's getting bigger or smaller if you want to go the other way. Let me show you the individual template. Here's the individual template. With this template, it works very similarly. Just drag and drop an extracted subject into the template, position them where you want them to go, and then the tutorial will teach you how to paint with white on the mask to make them revealed over top of the paper. Of course, you can change the colors just like in the other template and adjust that to whatever color you want. And it's just as easy as that. Of course, you can still add in the claws, talons, or signatures that you want to into this also. These make incredible posters, banners, and prints for parents. Hope you enjoy it.